Uh, still on Christmas issues, some livestock farmers in Techiman say sales have not been good this Christmas season. Bono Region correspondent Anna Sabit has been engaging them and has more in this report. Christmas is here at last and we are here at the Techiman Sheep and Goat Market. We want to engage the sellers here on how their sales has been compared to the same period last year. We want to find out whether the uh, buyers are coming in their numbers or whether it is the opposite and if they are able to buy as expected. Let's get interactive with the sellers here. This Christmas is one of the worst. We do not know if it is the elections or the higher exchange rates. So things are really bad here. Honestly, we are recording low sales here. It may be as a result of the elections. We don't know if there will be improvement going forward, but this year things are really bad. We are facing difficulties because there are no buyers here. For the past days, this is what we are experiencing. We go for the animals, but no buyers. A number of them attribute their low sales to the high exchange rate of the silver. As these animals are being imported from neighboring countries such as Cote d'Ivoire, Burkina Faso, and Togo. So the high exchange rate, according to the people here, is affecting their sales this festive season. A few way the Yamienim market now confirm. The entire man confirm this say we are recording those sales this year because of the exchange rates. We bring these animals from the neighboring countries, and the exchange rate has been high, and that's affecting our sales. Comparing this year to last year, the market has been bad because of the rate of the safer. The buyers are not coming to. While some attribute the low sales to the exchange rate, others have the view that uh, this particular Christmas, coming after the elections, could be also another contributing factor to the low sales of the animals. For me, I believe the elections is the cause of our low sales. They, however, have some suggestions to authorities. They call on governments to uh, come to their aid by working on controlling the exchange rate of the safer in order to stabilize the uh, Ghana city, and that, according to them, will increase their sales going forward. We call on authorities to work on improving the local currency. Once it gains strength against the SIFA, we will make profit after sales. We wish they could help boost the strength of the Ghana city against the SIFA. If that is done, things may improve here too. So from the sheep and goat market here at the Techiman Central Market, my name is Anna Sabit, reporting for Joy News. That was announced there from Tichiman. Let's now gauge the scene here in Accra as my colleague Nicholas Brown has been engaging uh, some traders at the central market at Old Fodama. Hooray! Christmas is here and of course, what is Christmas without a grilled goat, you know, on your table. So, we are here at the central market, Old Fadama, where goats are being sold wholesale to find out how sales are going. I'm saying every monday at the abandono eh yeri mono free no for area basa at we talk a crack crack there but they how say this year mono boy dey ni the amani boy dey dey say you say for no e kosoro pa yen timi sisa first last year sisa this time eh 5000 say for no be say yi 42 gana city but this year, yes, it's only 57 Ghana city. 
nti ama emono ebru ebu ay kosoro pa okay it has been so good uh, we know normally in the festive season like this things go up especially they say for us the chairman already said but we are doing well and uh, we sell small and we too we get it small small so we thank god for that because uh, before the christmas we buy CFA 5,000 is uh, 48 CD, 49 CD, uh, 5,000 CFA. But as we enter the Christmas, we change it for 570, 57 Ghana CD for 5,000 CFA. So the gold that we normally used to sell like uh, 350 CD, now we are supposed to sell it like 450. So it has made the sales slow, but we still tell so far how is it going are people coming in to purchase livestock or not people are coming but it's not like the way we used to see the previous years yes things have changed because of the distance people are coming one one yes yeah so talk to me about the you know cost of the livestock uh, I earlier spoke to your colleagues and they said that the CIFA has affected the cost of the livestock. Talk to me about that. Okay, this time around, because of the exchange rate, the CIFA is high. So that has also affected the, 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 uh, the, the prices. So maybe a normal side goods that can fit a family, maybe 500, 450. You can get some 300, I bet it's too small. Yes, we have 1,800. But previously it wasn't like that. Yes, this time around the CIFA has gone high. That has affected the, 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 the prices. Mm -hmm. I call it to say this year, no, Chefano, a ma woman, but but Tom one and Papa May. This Christmas, things are not going well with us. They are not people are not coming. We don't know whether because of the convict or we don't just know Kura at all. Uh, people are not coming like the previous Christmas. Uh, yeah. So we are appealing the government to come to it because we don't just know what is happening. Ever since the, this in the, the convict, people are not coming like that. Oh, they are buying. They are buying. Mm, they are purchasing it. Mm. So far, uh, you can say that you are making good business? Oh, it's fine. It, uh, Is the exchange rate on the safer affecting the cost of the livestock? Okay, truly, it's, it's affected us. But it's not it's alone. Because of the animals too, they are not coming more. They are not there at the Burkina itself. They struggle before they get some. Because of the, they too, they get some pamphlets. So they are, they are afraid to go to the bush and bring the animals. So that is the major problem. Uh, but the CFA is, from beginning, the CFA is going up. It's not coming down. But if the animals come plenty, you can beat the price and buy and come and sell. But if the animals did not there, you have to buy high and come and sell low. Uh -huh. So that is affecting us a lot. So as you rightly heard from the traders here at the central market, at the old Fadama, where goods are being sold for wholesale, they are complaining that you know the exchange rate on the SEFA is affecting their business. My name is Nicholas Brown for Joy Business.